2020 Sports with Mark Breen. Uh, well, Breen's on the road with the Knicks, and so our guys here, uh, Warner Wolf. Good morning, Warner. Good morning. Oh, Thank you very much, John, man. Come on, get him out. <laughs> Come on, get him out of here, right? Another bull of the week to the NBA list of 50 greatest players. This week, seven former NBA players are voted into the Basketball Hall of Fame. JoJo White, Sidney Moncrief, Bobby Jones, Jamal Wilkes, Alex English, Dennis Johnson, and Gus Johnson. What do these seven guys have in common? Records. Well. <laughs> no, not records. But <laughs> all seven were left off last week's list of the greatest 50 players. In uh, other words, they're good enough for the Basketball Hall of Fame, but they're not good enough for the list of 50. Oh, Get them out. Oh, God. God. Hey. Hey. Set yourself on fire. Make a statement. <laughs> no surprise, the baseball owners have done it again, sabotaging their own game, turning down the latest labor agreement. The owners needed 23 votes. They got only 12. Here's acting commissioner and Brewers owner, Bud Seelig. I think both sides have genuinely tried. I know there's no question in my mind that they have. Um, hopefully, we're closer now than we ever have been before. So I, I, I would like at least to focus on the positives. I'd like you to blow up. <laughs> focus on this. Genuinely. Yeah, Genuinely. Just what is that, a new a, word? Yeah, what a Come on, this guy's the acting commissioner. <laughs> Boom. Get, Get him out of here. Absolutely. Come on. National League Rookie of the Year, Dodger center fielder Todd Hollinsworth. Hit 291, the fifth straight Dodger to win the National League Rookie of the Year award. That is scouting. Unbelievable. That is a scouting system. Yeah, you got I it. Agree. 13 Boston College football players suspended for betting on football in the World Series, including two players who admitted they bet against Boston College, oh, their own that. team, Whoa. in the Syracuse game. Oh, come on. Scandal. Syracuse was 13-point favorite. They won by 38. Huh. Well... So, so if, if you, you had, had <laughs> if you had Boston College in 37, no yeah, wonder you yeah, lost. Yeah, you lost. You're of course loser. you lost. <laughs> Basketball coach Jim Herrick, coach of the year only two years ago, UCLA won the NCAA championship, fired because of alleged NCAA.